Hi, I'm Garrett. This is Matt, Nicola, and Aaron. Let's get shredded. Grab your dumbbells. We're gonna go right into a bent over row. So hinge at the waist and then pull right up. Just like that, good. Nice steady pace. Keep your head in a nice neutral position. You don't have to look at the screen right now. Keep that in a nice neutral position. Just relax the head, I'll do the talking. Keep going. We're doing 12 repetitions. Nice steady pace. Keep going, you got this. Really working that back, keeping those abs tight. Right into Arnold presses. Right up, underhand, and rotate up. Good, just like that. You got it, keep going. A little faster, let's pick the pace up a little bit. Once you got the move, nice steady pace. Keeping those abs tight, and this is gonna sculpt those shoulders. Let's go. Keep going, we got 12, let's keep going. We have five more. Here we go, keep going. All right, we're about to go right into the reciprocal rows. Here we go, right into the reciprocal rows. Same thing as the regular row, we're gonna go back and forth though. Really go, really move. Both arms should be moving at the same time. So work those back, work those shoulders, hitting everything right here. Keep those abs tight, because we're shredding those abs up. Let's go. Keep going. All right. We're going right into alternating presses. We're only working our shoulders here. Let's go, keeping those abs tight. Keep going. Back and forth, here we go. You got it, almost there. Three more, two, one more. All right, if you need a little sip of water, all right, go ahead and grab that sip of water and then right back to the bent over rows. Let's go right into the bent over rows. As you can see here, keeping the back nice and flat, go ahead and begin, let's go. Good, a little slower here. One, two, three, three, two, one. We're only going eight repetitions on this one, so nice and slow. If you need to go a little lighter weight, go ahead and get that lighter weight. If you need to go heavier, go heavier. All right, really squeezing that back. You're really working to what we call your, your lat and relax. We're gonna go right into the Arnold press. Right here, rotating out, pressing up. Good, really working those shoulders, nice. And for you ladies here, this is really hitting that shoulder as you can see here. Nicholas' shoulder has got great development and this is gonna get that. There you go, keep going, nice. Slow it down a little bit, let's slow it down. We're only doing eight repetitions. Last one, good. Now let's go right into the reciprocal rows. You're gonna hinge at the waist. See, just get the back nice and flat. You're gonna keep that nice and flat and then just keeping her abs nice and tight. She's pushing and pressing and pulling at the same time. Let's go, keep going, you got it. Slow it down a little bit, let's slow it down. Good, keep going, nice and slow, good. All right, stand right up. Let's go right into the alternating pressing. Let's go, up, nice, here you go. Good, slow it down a little bit. Three, two, one. One, two, three, good, keep going, nice. Keeping those abs tight, chest up, everything's a straight, perfect line, that's what you want. And these are the, you're gonna get the great shoulder development you want if you do this, and relax. Good, now let's go on to our next circuit. You might wanna go lighter weight, or you might wanna go a little bit heavier weight. I would start with a little lighter. We're gonna go right upright row, let's go. Starting up, good, just like that. Alternating them. Elbows high, squeeze to the back of your shoulder. That's what we're developing right here. Keep going, nice and slow. Good, keep that tempo up, we're almost there. Keep going, we're doing 12 repetitions now, because this is our second circuit. Good, all right, right to the rear delt fly. Hinge up the waist, back flat. If you need a little lighter weight, go ahead and do that. And squeeze to the rear of the shoulder, good. Still hitting that back of your shoulder, keep going. You're gonna look great with a backless dress for you guys. It's always that weakest part of your shoulder that you never work. Here we go. Keep going. Nice, steady. Keep going. All right, you got it. Three more. Two more. Last one. L raises, standing straight, standing tall. Making that L. Good. Keep going. We're alternating them. Nice, keeping the arms right equal to the head. If you wanna go any higher than that. Right shoulder level. We're not bouncing or swinging. We're controlling the weight up and down. Keep going, nice. You got this. Here we go. Pump them out, the shoulders should start burning now. Last one, good. We're gonna start that 90 degree lateral raise into rotation. 90 degrees, lateral rotation. Good, back down, lateral raise, rotation. Back down, good, keep going. Good, we got 12 of those. Shoulders are burning. I know you can do it, good. A little slower, here we go, nice. 
rotation. Shoulders are on fire. That's good. Maybe next time let's go down a little lighter weight. Because remember, we're going to go to eight repetitions and we're going to slow it down to a three second in, three second up. Good. Keep going. Two more. Battle raise. Good. Keep going. Last one. Good. All right. If you need to go lighter, go ahead and go lighter. We're going to go to the alternating upright row. So slow it down a little bit. Nice and slow. Here we go. Three, two, one. One, two, three. Slower, a little slower. Three. There you go. Two, one. Nice. Just at that pace, that's a perfect speed for you. As you can see over here, really squeezing through the back of that shoulder. That's nice. Good. Keeping those abs tight. A little slight bend in the knees. Everything's nice and tight. Keeping the body upright. That is perfect. Good form, Nicola. Good. Here we go. You got this. Almost there. We're only doing eight repetitions now. Good. Now, you might want to go in a lighter weight here because this is going to be a lot harder on the del fly here. And good. Hinge at the waist. Now, so you can go right into the rear del fly. That's what you're going to do right here. Slow. Three, two, one. A little slower. Three, two, one. Two, one. Good. Perfect. That's what you want. You want it nice and slow. You're really going to get that squeeze here. This is different than month one. We're not going fast. We're going a little slower here because we're going to build some strength. Good. Keep going. Three more, guys. You got it. You can do it at home. Three more. Good. Two more. Nice and slow. Control squeezing. You can see that shoulder just firing. Last one all the way up. Slowly down and relax. Good. Right into those L raises. Take your arms out if you need to. That's great. Ready? Let's go. Right up. Good. Right to the other side. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Good. Three, two, one. One, two, three. Slow it down. There you go. It's not about speed. It's about quality of the workout here. Good. You got this. Now, guys, this is really going to develop the side of your shoulder when it comes to the lateral side. It's also hitting the front of that shoulder. It's going to get you ripped to the bone. There you go. Nice. Slow it down just a little bit more, guys. A little slower. We don't want to go too fast. Nice and slow. Good. Keeping those abs tight. Shoulders back. He's not rocking back and forth. Good. You got this. Keep going. Perfect form. Make sure to breathe. Don't hold your breath. We're going to go one more each side. Let's go. One. Last one here. Then you're going to go right into your 90 degree lateral raises. Ready? 90 degrees. Rotation. Nice. Slow it down. Slow it down. Here we go. Really going to get that development that you want? This is what you're going to do right here. Good. Perfect. Let's go. You can really feel that shoulder firing. I can see it right here in his muscles. As he's rotating, it's really firing. It's really good for your rotator cuff. If you work on an office job all day, this is a great exercise for you to open up those shoulders. Good. Keep going. And it's going to get you shredded to the bone. Slow it down just a little bit. Two more. Good. One more. This is your last one. Nice and slow. All the way up. All the way back. And then you're gonna go, I'll drop it. Good, relax. You think we're done? No, we're not. Let's go right to the arm circles. This is our last exercise. You can do it. Abs tight, shoulders up, keeping the hands flat out. And then we're gonna do full, we're gonna go backwards. Let's go. Keep going. We're gonna go this for 15 seconds. Keep going. Moving those shoulders. It should be really on fire right now. But you can do it. We're almost there. And let's go forward. Here we go. Nice and slow. Really getting that movement in that shoulder. Keeping those abs tight. Got to keep that core tight. Make sure you're breathing, though. Here we go. We're almost there. All right, we're going to go backwards. Squeezing through the shoulder blades. Really working the back of the shoulder. So we just hit the front of the shoulder, the back of the shoulder, side of our shoulder. Here we go. Now let's go up and up. Good. Keep going. Nice and slow. Not in a race. We're not, time is time. You can't make it go any faster. And relax. That's your back and shoulder workout.